Welcome to the Excrete Process Channel. Today, we will follow the journey of transporting giant machines such as the Leaper R984 Excavator, kept 1450 and Volvo EC650 steel giants specializing in large-scale mining and construction projects. To move these steel monsters, people need super heavy trailers, specialized vehicles that can carry loads of up to hundreds of tons, with hydraulic systems to adjust height and prevent tilting when turning sharply. On steep, winding roads, controlling a convoy of vehicles tens of meters long requires extremely precise steering and many years of experience. The vehicle is performing an extremely challenging task, transporting an excavator weighing more than 100 tons through the most dangerous roads, where every bend, every slope, is potentially dangerous. As the vehicle approaches the steep slope, the challenge is raised a notch. The massive weight of the excavator makes each meter of the climb a real test of the engine, brakes, and driver's composure. There is a sharp 90 degree turn ahead. The visibility is almost blocked. In this situation, we cannot rely on the steering wheel alone. There needs to be someone to assist in front, waving to guide, watching every centimeter, helping the vehicle pass the turn safely on the steep pass. The challenge is raised to another level. The enormous weight of the excavator makes every meter of the climb a real test for the engine, brakes, and the driver's composure. On the way, the convoy suddenly encountered an obstacle ahead. At this time, the distance from the top of the machine to the obstacle was only a few centimeters, or even impossible to pass. If they continued to move forward, the risk of collision, damage to the machine and the construction was very high. The chosen option lowered the machine from the trailer and let the transport vehicle pass first. The machine is temporarily allowed to go around the other side of the obstacle. Let's see how the driver controls the excavator onto the truck. These seemingly simple operations are actually the pinnacle of coordination between machines and humans. Just a few careless tilts or wheel deviations can cause the whole 100-ton machine to overturn. That's why construction machine operators not only need a driver's license but also experience and steel fortitude. With super heavy construction machines like Leaper R984 were kept 1,450, climbing slopes from the rear of the vehicle is impossible due to the large length, high center of gravity, which can easily cause overturning or breaking the slope. The solution used up and down from the side, that is, the middle part of the trailer body, 
where there is a special design that is lowered close to the ground, making it easy for the machine to access. After getting on the truck, the excavator's bucket is lowered close to the floor, reducing the overall height and increasing stability. Next, the technical team will use iron chains to lock the wheels and anchor the fur corners, ensuring that it does not move even when going through rough terrain. When getting off the vehicle, a special technique is used, using the bucket as a fulcrum. The driver lowers the bucket arm close to the ground, then rests the bucket on the ground to support the front of the machine. At this time, the front track is suspended or just touches the slope. The main force is shared through the bucket arm, helping the machine not to overturn due to the slope being too steep. It is impossible not to praise the drivers who participated in this journey. The driver of the specialized tractor trailer, with his keen eyes and ability to control the vehicle with dozens of wheels smoothly handled every dangerous curve, every tense climb as if he were, leading an entire symphony orchestra on a challenging road. Meanwhile, the excavator operator, with steady hands and centimeter precise calculations, showed true class. Controlling the giant steel block up and down the slope, moving forward and backward in the right position, without missing a single inch, required extreme concentration and extensive experience. The most impressive thing is the smooth coordination between the two people. No shouting, no rushing, just signals, eye contact and sometimes just a slight nod. But the result is that the entire giant excavator is lifted up and down smoothly, neatly and convincingly. This is not just skill, but the pinnacle of understanding, professionalism and trust between people who work in the field of operating heavy equipment. Thank you for watching the video. If you find the video interesting, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to the Excrete Process channel to continue following other super impressive journeys of the world of industrial machinery.